Hello friends, I hope you are fine. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today it's 24th of August 2021 and two hours ago I had my second dose of Pfizer vaccine. So far everything looks good, I'm not feeling any fever and uh, I really wanted to record this video. Uh, today I'm also very happy that I have got 11 subscribers on my channel which is kind of great um, milestone uh, because I have barely published like 10 to 10 videos so far but I am planning to publish more and more videos on this channel. Uh, I am actually targeting uh, uh, starters uh, uh, those people who want to start learning iOS as well as mid-level and senior uh, level so kind of uh, mix uh, multi-prong strategy so far on my channel uh, and uh, uh, today I want to discuss um, uh, different resources which are available uh, which you can utilize to level up your iOS development skills. Uh, if, you are one, if you are junior iOS or mid-level iOS developer and you want to level up uh, your skills and motivation and result can be different um, for example you want to level up your skill to uh, ask for more salary or uh, learn more skills uh, which help you become expert in ios development and this list is not based on uh, best to uh, like lower rating um, but it is just random order and I will discuss uh, one by one all these resources and share my experience which will help you uh, basically uh, select or ideally you should look at most of those resources and um, get uh, the idea that what they talk about and stick to uh, those uh, websites or blog and uh, practice those skills and uh, level up your skills so let's uh, and now before that uh, this uh, video is not sponsored by any of these uh, these are purely my suggestion and if you know any other resource uh, please let me know in your comments i'm sure that there must be some other great resources out there uh, which help you become expert in ios uh, but th this is pure my opinion. So without further ado, let's discuss one by one. First resource that I'm going to talk about is WWDC videos. Every year they publish uh, videos, tech videos related to iOS, Mac and every new technology uh, that they publish. So you can filter it uh, over here and look at uh, those uh, videos related to your interest. And these are very good videos and it is recommended for every iOS developer to have a look at it even uh, in interviews they ask about are you updated with uh, new iOS trends so this is the best and free resource that I would recommend uh, even in your company and uh, in your team you can uh, assign uh, like one video to each developer and they can uh, present and you can learn from that in this way it is learning easier instead of if you are doing it on individual basis uh, I would also recommend you to look at old videos like from 2020 2019 18 and uh, so so because some of the great stuff uh, has been discussed in old videos as well sometime and in one year they present basic um, version of the video and in the next year they go in depth so you can uh, look at old videos and get benefit from this those that i want to discuss about is website rave and uh, if we go to his website um, it has um, although multiple categories like iOS and Swift, Android, Kotlin, Flutter, server side and game development Unity. Uh, uh, Ray basically is uh, one of the uh, very few people who started writing about iOS 
uh, they started with uh, game, game development and later uh, broaden it to other categories as well they have uh, articles books and some of free videos are also available uh, they also offer a paid subscription uh, for some of the videos for example if five videos uh, out of two would be free and you have to subscribe uh, like annual base subscription or I think mon monthly base uh, otherwise they also uh, publish articles uh, I really like their style and then keep on adding and explaining uh, it is one of the resource that uh, I picked up um, when I was um, basically uh, learning iOS development back in 2009 so really um, good resource to keep yourself updated with iOS development uh, and the third a uh, resource that I want to talk about is Objective-C.io uh, I guess the website and name is uh, because at that time uh, around 2013 they started this website and they have books, issue uh, articles and Swift UI latest talks as well they have also uh, monthly and annual subscription as well what I like about uh, this website is um, I'm a fan of um, basically watching people do how uh, refactor their code and basically how they uh, think when they are working on a, uh, some project. So all in all these videos, um, like both of these uh, founders, uh, they basically uh, not only write code but um, think aloud as well that what is the reasoning why they are thinking and then uh, taking a simple code and expanding it further and further uh, I, I enjoyed their some of the series for example refactoring large scale view controller uh, building form libraries uh, and uh, other and I, I have uh, <laughs> I have subscribed uh, to their videos as well so it is one of the great resource uh, that I would recommend uh, they have also free article as well uh, where you can fi find old um, article that they publish um, one of my colleague uh, recommended this and I'm really thankful to him for this and uh, it's a great uh, resource if you want to level up your skills and the other resource that I want to talk about is pointfree.co and they have uh, published um, very good um, um, videos um, they basically do hands-on some of uh, the sessions are free uh, while uh, others are paid um, but uh, what I found is that they although their approach is good they start from simple and then complex uh, build complex structure on that but uh, like if if I would rate in terms of complexity uh, objective C dot IO uh, and this this one is way advanced than that so if if you want to you can have a look at some of the videos and get the idea that um, like what is the level of uh, the problem that they are discussing and uh, then decide that from where you should take a start um, but it is one of the very um, uh, very good and um, most technical stuff related to iOS and Swift you can find uh, so uh, the next resource that I'm going to talk about uh, you can find their YouTube channel as well it is essential developer and uh, they have a bunch of videos available on YouTube where they talk to different developer and uh, basically solve their problem recently they have uh, they have run a, I think bootcamp paid bootcamp 
um, uh, Shao and Mike, uh, they run this uh, website. And uh, uh, they have also uh, covered some good stuff uh, related to uh, all those uh, concepts which are required to make you a better iOS engineer or transition to from junior to senior iOS developer. The course that I'm going to talk about is Swift by Sundar. And if you look at the website, he has videos about different topics and as well art articles as well. Um, I have uh, found some of the videos uh, on YouTube where he spoke at different conferences. And what I like about is that not only the great content that he presents at every conference and talk, but the enthusiasm that uh, he speaks about the topic it's really fascinating uh, it's uh, most of the uh, stuff on that i found on his website uh, it is free um, and it discuss uh, some of the prob problems that are um, we handle based on a daily basis for example how to uh, design your app, make uh, your view controllers lightweight, some of the latest stuff uh, related to Swift UI, uh, reactive programming. Uh, you can find a variety of articles on his um, website. So it is one of the very good resources to stay in touch if you want to level up your skill. And the next resource that I want to talk about is hacking with Swift um, again this resource is um, this website it targets uh, starters as well as mid-level and senior level resources um, you can find articles um, videos on this website uh, related to iOS, Swift, Objective-C, I guess maybe somewhere, uh, but um, um, great content, um, very precise. They have published um, uh, an app on I on App Store um, for learning Swift. Uh, so maybe you want to check that out as well. Uh, they have free as well as uh, paid subscription uh, where. Uh, you might want to look at that uh, also on his YouTube channel there is a lot of content free of cost you can look at and learn from it uh, the next re uh, resource that I want to talk about is a website Khanlu um, this um, I found his talk on YouTube uh, regarding MVVMC, uh, great con uh, great content and mix uh, kind of content which targets um, junior, mid-level, senior resource uh, as well. Uh, you can have a look at it website and um, get benefit from it. Um, some of the very detailed topics in depth. So to check it out as well. I want to talk about is iOS Dev Weekly. Uh, they publish uh, their article as well as um, curates a list of articles from different websites. For example, you can see hackingwithswift.com, uh, which is run by Paul Hudson, and this another website. Uh, they are really popular because uh, not only the good stuff that they bring in, but also it's been almost 10 years since they are publishing uh, stuff related to iOS development. So a really good resource. Uh, and the last um, but not the least, uh, the other website that I want to talk about is medium.com. Uh, you might be surprised that uh, they basically uh, present uh, really good stuff, not only related to other uh, categories, uh, but also iOS development. You can uh, follow some of the uh, groups or um, channels. You can say that 
um, for example better programming and there you, you will receive basically article uh, I have subscribed to some of the uh, some of people which uh, really write good technical stuff um, very popular uh, resource these days um, they have free membership as well as paid uh, I guess monthly there is a limit for free members but if you want to you know consume more and more content then you might consider uh, subscri paid, uh, paid subscription so um, like there could be other resources as well uh, for example in the form of books uh, some good github projects uh, which you can look at their source code and try to understand uh, and basically level up your skills um, and there might be also some other great um, websites or blogs uh, which I'm not familiar if that is so please uh, let me know in your uh, comments um, and uh, if you're uh, you find this helpful and interested in learning more stuff related to iOS um, please subscribe my channel so that YouTube algorithm can pick up this channel and recommend to other people as well so till next time bye bye